A growing trend in the pet world has landed on the first coast. A cat cafe. It's a place where you can have coffee, pastries, all while playing with little kitty cats. And today I went to the new one that just opened up in St. Augustine. Yeah. Would you guys like um, a coffee? At the Frisky Cat Cafe, coffee is on the menu. Are you coming in? And cats are the entertainment. Come over here and let them come crawl okay. on you. Carla Forrest is bringing the Cat Cafe concept to St. Augustine after losing her banking job of 20 years last year. Cat cafes were kind of a thing. I did some research on it. The idea is you have coffee and sweets in the cafe in the front room. And if you want, you can take the goodies into the back room to chill with the cool cats. If you keep the two spaces separate and you keep the, um, the, the front separate from the back, then, you know, FDAX, which is the Florida Department of Agriculture, allows us to have both. It's so tiny. All of them are rescue cats from different, from different people. And all the cats are up for adoption. Every visit with the cats costs $10. We appreciate people coming in just as much as adopting them because that helps us fund their medical care. I think it's wonderful. I've had cats all my life, so um, they're thinking I leave with one, but I'm not. No, I'm not. Okay. I'm going to be strong. <laughs> right now, you have to have an appointment to come and hang out with the little kitty cats. So, Forrest made the most out of losing her job last year, tapping into her passion for finding homes for kitties. Oh, there's this old saying that, you know, do what you love and fit the rest in your life. For Forrest and others, it seems this new venture may just be the cat's pajamas. Too big. You know, okay, so remember, appointments are needed right now uh, because uh, there are only so many cats in that room and they just opened up, so she's getting used to the space and she doesn't want the cats to be scared. Uh, but over time, that might change.